Hello folks, greetings, welcome to another episode of The Crazy Cover, woohoo! Thank you Shirley Jean for that introduction. Yes, it's me. Settle down in your couches boys and girls and get your popcorn ready. We're going to do a mail call. Well, first thing is I had to relocate my stickers to the house here because the the garage atmosphere and whatever stuff goes on there is not copacetic to the stickers. Uh, I still got a bunch more stickers to move in here. Some of my very first ones are still stuck on that goofy magnet on the door, so I have to get them off and transfer them to the to this board and uh, we'll all be happy and now I can see y'all uh, every morning in my room no this is not the room at the hospital at the, the asylum this is the room at the house that I get to stay in when I'm not in trouble so uh, you know bear with me oh by the way I've run out of stickers of my own so if any of y'all got any ideas on what my next sticker should be or smell or look like, uh, be sure to let me know because I'm not that creative and everybody's got, they've always had better stickers than me. So, which I love, I'd rather get your stickers as mine anyway. <laughs> anyway, here we go. Let me get y'all closer and explain some of this stuff. Now, if I forget anybody, uh, shoot me. I've been shot before. It's not It's not as good as you think it is. It, it burns, actually. Okay. Now, we got you gone, Carrie. And Mr. In-Debt for Kids, building that 56 pickup. And Mr. John Carrie, building that big Jaguar. Which is complicated as a, I don't know. It looks like a spaceship to me. But he's a good man doing it. Here's Mr. Steve. He does all sorts of cool stuff. And the outlaw himself, Grim Reaper. This boy here is building him a Scout Pontiac uh, monstrosity. It's going to be pretty neat. It'll be a show car when he's done. Here's Mr. Dean's truck. He's building a wonderful truck. Of course, long wheelbase, which is good to me. I put a little bit of yellow paint on it and stuff. I'm going to uh, do some more to it. My cousin, Mark, Stunt, Mark Sponge. South Australia. There you go. He sent me that and a nice letter and hair BMW. He is brand new and he's doing great on his channel. So y'all check him out and all the rest of these boys. He talks good and he's easy to understand and he's even got interesting things to tell you. Here's my beautiful family here. They're very godly. Very sweet. I love them dearly. Well, I love all y'all dearly. That's the way you got to do it. And Mr. Tim, he's doing this man thing, which every time I watch it, my, uh, my computer grows chest hair. So, it's pretty manly. Here's my brother Greg's garage. He does everything or anything. He's a musician. Uh, he's a quite a good dancer, actually. And uh, he already sponsored us one of our get-togethers. He's done a wonderful job, especially for me. And I'm, I didn't know anything about Kansas City, and now I still don't. There's the heavy Chevy bunch. Sweet little girl, his wife, and he's got a wonderful family. Just all of them. I just can't. I just can't get over how sweet and special they all are. 
And uh, Marky's got that cool larb, that voice. I wish I had, but I guess I've not. I got hit in the throat a few times, and that kind of ruined my stuff. Uh, beautiful woman here, vapor lock fiction. She's the other side of of uh, Scott stole boat 50. She's actually the the best side, I have to say. And he's a dandy too. My brother, Scott. This sticker's been all over the earth. I've had it to snap on. I've had it all sorts of places. And uh, now it's home with me where it's supposed to be. He's a wonderful guy, and he's got a wonderful family, too. Woohoo! And these boys here, they've done a lot of changing, and it's all to the good, which is, I can't say that. They're wonderful folks, too. And this is Mr. George, Shade 3 Fix It Man. I don't know why he... This sticker has got him wearing red pumps. I don't know what kind of signal he's trying to send me, but it kind of looks like the Wicked Witch of the East with the ruby slippers, but somebody's dropped a hot rod on them. Here's Dr. Bruce. He does all sorts of cool stuff and has been doing some cool stuff all of his life. He is a very, very talented scientist and all sorts of accolades and stuff. I can't spell that, but I can say it. Accolades, and he's just probably the smartest one of us. Here's Mr. Bruce. He's very talented. Anything he touches turns out good. He can draw, he can sling mud, he can cut, and he can weld, and all sorts of stuff. He's a wonderful guy. Check him out. Here is the frame off. The man that's got the plan building the Ford pickup. He's doing it outside, by the way, which a lot of great cars and trucks are built outside. Uh, I like to work on outside because I can see better out there. When you get old, the, the light leaves your eyes. And uh, he's doing a wonderful job. Really neat guy. Canadian. Another Canadian, Mr. Snow Crusher, I got the pleasure of meeting him, and he's just a lovable guy, and his sweet wife, so good, and uh, they're just wonderful, you just got to check them out, they do some really cool stuff, and let's see, moving on to some more blessings, is... Mr. Scott Best sent me him and his Mary sent me some cool stuff. I asked Miss Mary about some of her favorite English recipes. She just sent me a big blooming book. And uh, Scott even narrated some of this stuff. The stuff that he's eaten. He's got, you know, Recommendations and, and, and memories of what of of the uh, the food that's in here, and that's really special to me to put a part of him in it. And he sent me all these Vitesse and Harold books to keep me started on the build that I'm starting at the garage of my little '63 Harold. So well, that was very special. Thank you so much there, Scotty boy and family. Lovely. I love you. love you very much. And, uh, well, I don't know how long this camera don't, don't say. Uh, I'll give you a panorama of the, my lair, room, whatever you want to call it. There's my uh, idols. Let's see, up there is a one slice toaster. I don't know why. There's a Crosley radio. 
Crosley, Crosley, Godzilla. Oh, he's got a hold of Cutworm. Yeah. And let's see. Here's some Cooper stuff on my wall. There's a hand drawn picture from James Fountain of my 49 Ford, the one that George fixed up for me. And some granddaughters. And Mary Ann. Goober stuff up there. Things and things and things and junk and junk and junk and junk. Uncle Harold. Crosley. There's the peaks. There's Morris. Children. Weapons. Dogs. Uh, Mighty Mouse. Cokes. Skelly. Jeep. Shimp. Weapons. This. And I think that's it. I hate to, but I gotta turn this around and let y'all see the. I got to do the ending part of this. Come to find out. Alright. Whee! I'm getting drunk. Uh, y'all have fun. And you know I love you. And I uh, hope you enjoyed this. So, uh, I'm gonna say, so I'm not you to you. Okay. Bye-bye.